God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. I confess to Almighty God, and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned. In my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore I ask the Blessed Mary, ever virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. Psalm 86 Turn your ear, O Lord, and give answer, for I am poor and needy. Preserve my life, for I am faithful. Save the servant who trusts in you. You are my God. Have mercy on me, Lord, for I cry to you all day long. Give joy to your servant, O Lord, for to you I lift up my soul. O Lord, you are good and forgiving, full of love to all who call. Give heed, O Lord, to my prayer, and attend to the sound of my voice. In the day of distress I will call, and surely you will reply. Among the gods there is none like you, O Lord, nor work to compare with yours. All the nations shall come to adore you. The glory of your name, O Lord. For you are great and do marvelous deeds, you who alone are God. Show me, Lord, your way, so that I may walk in your truth. Guide my heart to fear your name. I will praise you, Lord my God, with all my heart, and glorify your name forever. For your love to me has been great. You have saved me from the depths of the grave. The proud have risen against me. Ruthless men seek my life. To you they pay no heed. But you, God of mercy and compassion, slow to anger, O Lord, abounding in love and truth, turn and take pity on me. O give your strength to your servant and save your handmaid son. Show me the sign of your favor that my foes may see to their shame, that you console me and give me your help. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. First Thessalonians chapter 5, verses 9 and 10. God has destined us for acquiring salvation through our Lord Jesus Christ. He died for us, that all of us, whether awake or asleep, together might live with him. Luke chapter 2, verses 29 through 32. Lord, now you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people, a light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Protect us, Lord, as we stay awake. Watch over us as we sleep. That awake, we make you watch with Christ, and asleep, rest in his peace. Lord, give our bodies restful sleep, and let the work we have done today bear fruit in eternal life. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. May the all-powerful Lord grant us a restful night and a peaceful death. Amen.